Hi friends! I've got a really silly story to read today. It's called Alice the Fairy. This was written by David Shannon. Do you see this girl dressed up like a fairy? What do you think is part of her fairy costume? I noticed a wand and some wings and a crown. She's dressed up like a fairy. Let's read this together. Alice the Fairy. My name is Alice. I'm a fairy. I'm not a permanent fairy. I'm a temporary fairy. You have to pass a lot of tests to be a permanent fairy. I have wings so I can fly. I can't fly very high yet, but I can fly really fast. This is my magic wand. This is my blanket. Fairies use magic wands to change frogs into princes and things like that. I changed my dad into a horse. See how he's giving her a ride? One time, my mom made cookies for my dad. So I turned them into mine. Hmm. I felt bad about the cookies. So I thought I'd whip up a new outfit for my dad. Did I tell you he's the Duke of Morningside Drive? Well, he is. Gold sparkly pants, purplish pinkish shoes, my favorite color. But clothes were too hard. So I made him a new crown instead. Look what she made this crown with. I see noodles and buttons and sparkly glitter. With my magic wand, I can make leaves fall from trees. And I can draw pictures on water. Sometimes I use my magic wand to disappear. But that's kind of scary. I'd rather use my blanket. See how she's hiding under the blanket? Of course, I also have my magic mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairiest of them all? Well, what do you know? It's me, Alice. Thank you, mirror. Mmm, fairy dust is very useful. I like to use it to turn oatmeal into cake. Casting spells is another important part of being a fairy. Watch me make my dog float on the ceiling. Hocus pocus, crokin docus. Hawkin, taukin, riggin, falcon. Doggin, floggin, biddle noggin. Okay, that one needs a little work. He did not float to the ceiling. But a fairy must be very careful with magic. Once I accidentally turned my white dress into a red one. And that made the Duchess so mad, she locked me in the tower forever. I got away, though. You see what happened to her dress? Do you think magic turned her white dress red? It looks like it was maybe a spill. A fairy's life is filled with danger. Broccoli is often poisoned by the wicked duchess and should never be eaten. Fairies also hate baths. I'd like to turn my bath water into strawberry jello. That would be fun, but I don't know how yet. A jello bath, how silly. You have to be a permanent fairy to do tricks like that. They go to advanced fairy school to learn how. I'm supposed to learn how to make clothes get up on the floor and dance around and line up in the closet. That would be a good trick. I'm not very good at that, though. She's not putting her clothes away. <sighs> I'll probably be a temporary fairy forever.
What a silly story. I think Alice has so much fun acting like a fairy at her house with her wings and her magic wand and her crown. So fun. I love to play dress up. If you would like to read more stories with me, you can click the link below to subscribe to this channel. We read books together all the time. And if you'd like to learn even more things on a screen just like this, I have a virtual preschool class and we learn together all the time. There's a link below for that too. All right, friends, I'll see you next time. Keep reading.